Okay, everyone, welcome to my little garage here. Uh, today I'm going to be showing you how to test fuel injectors, direct injection fuel injectors. These are out of a 2009 Volkswagen CC with a 2 liter turbo engine. Anyway, uh, I had that typical carbon buildup on the intakes like most direct injection engines do. Um, but anyway, I was going through these and cleaning them and um, testing on their flow and how clean the nozzles are. And I'm going to show you how you can test them at home. Um, so what I have here is brake parts cleaner. Um, you can use this, you can use carb cleaner, pretty much any solvent in an aerosol can. Uh, the aerosol can is just for the pressure we need to build. So to test them um, I've just gotten two jumper leads. I've got a battery and I've got some terminal connectors on them. So first one up I'm just going to show you two of them just as an example. So I've got these these are from a connector repin kit. Um, they were small enough to fit inside here. So we're going to connect the positive and the negative here. Now, I guess my connection was a little bit off inside there, but as you can hear now, it clicks. So now, um, I made this adapter myself. It's got, uh, I think there might be a, like a 3 8 hose going to a quarter inch hose, going to a 5 16 hose, and then the nozzle from the aerosol can that comes with it. Now it really only seals where these two hoses come together on that nozzle hose. So you gotta get that all the way in there and make sure that's sealed really well. Um, so we've got to get this o-ring off. Um, you can use your fingernails or pick. Grab it. So just get up underneath there. Now it is advised that you purchase a seal kit for these. I've already got mine on order. And then that hose will fit over that there. Then get yourself a catch can, pressurize it, just the button, and then tap your negative post. Do it again a couple times and get it nice and clean inside there. So that's that. So now we're going to test another one. So we'll test this one. We'll hook it up. Get a good connection on there this time for the first time. Come on, get on there. You can hear it click. We have a connection. Hook up our hose. Catch can. Pressurize. But it's just spraying. Anyway, we didn't even hook this up yet. So, this injector, I'm going to go with why last night. I had to limp my car home because that injector failed and was just constantly spraying fuel. So that being said, um, there's a lot of videos on how to get these injectors out. It's quite the lengthy process, but I hope this helps and 
I hope you learned something. Thanks.